Hello everyone, it's been a long time. I was a bit busy. I was abroad uh, for a while. So I'm glad to be back now and uh, I'm going to tie this pattern for uh, autumn grayling. And the hook is I'm using is size 14 bubblers. The bead is brass tungsten 2.4 millimeter. This is a red glow bright hot orange sorry number five. So this is just to give a little hot spot or I would say tug. So if you just start below the bead, you touch and turn. These are my favorite pattern I use myself in winter and autumn. So it works really well. I mean you can obviously use orange uh, sorry a uh, pink color but orange is my favorite because you also can catch a nice brown trout with it so if you come back with a touch and turn just need to give it some nice hot spot just go all the way down to the bend and then come back all the way now this is I need a bit chunky body here, so this is what I'm using a hot uh, glow bright. Just going to. I'm sorry, I'm using this um, hot orange to give a tug. So I'm going to go back and forward a few times to make a nice shape, and then finish off with this thread. Okay, the next thread I'm using is block A to and just start cover all this. I'm just gonna go all the way down towards the bend. Need to leave enough tag. And that should be okay. For the body I'm using, this is a dyed green peacock. Uh, so I can just chop this off and just catch this here. Cover it now the way. just don't want too much thread near the bead basically you can use super glue here to scale this or you can wrap this around the thread you can watch my other videos but I'm just gonna do this to demonstrate this to show you easier way I mean this is the body don't normally last long um, long enough because of this peacock hull, unless you just wrap this around the thread to secure it. Now, as you can see, it's got a really nice buggy look, and then catch it. Just a couple of turns to secure this. Right, uh, for the hackle I'm using, this is a Chinese hen hackle. It's a natural brown. Um, you don't need too bright because we've got a tag horse spot orange horse spot so just create a little tip here and gently take your time catch it once and pull everything back so we can secure this properly and then and just cut this extra piece off be careful don't drop any fibers okay it's a very delicate feather so gently use your hackle fly because they're too small and take your time here again now for the size of the hackle don't worry about it because it's, it's a wet fly so if, if the, even if they're long it's better they do pulsate nicely under water because I prefer them like this 
and you can pull all these back. And then secure it. Sorry guys, I haven't tried for a while so I'm just kind of a little bit slow here. I'm just going to see if anything is dropped. Yep, that's fine. And I'm just going to add a little varnish on the thread to secure it, seal it properly. Okay, and then we finish three. So there you have uh, another one of my favorite grading pattern for autumn. Also works for brown trout. So I hope you enjoyed this video guys and stay with me. I'm going to be uploading a lot more in this winter. Thank you very much.